Hi everyone and welcome to this episode. It's actually now the third time I'm trying to start this episode, but it's crashing on this cycle every time. So we've had three crashes so far on this place. I'm really hoping this is going to get through this time. I don't, maybe I'll just leave it. I'm just I'm just not going to do anything for a little while. Because if we can get through the first half a cycle and then uh, maybe it'll be fine after that. I don't know. But yeah, apologies for the technical issues tonight. I don't know what's causing them. Um... We haven't had any problems like this with Oni before, in terms, in terms of stability. Um, it might be a mod thing, but if it's a mod thing, it usually comes up with something to, to tell you and disable the mods, the mod managers. Or the in-game debug tells you what's crashed. We got print. Did we have a print last time? I don't remember having a print last time. Ah, okay. There's a, a power sharing a mod that tells me what the crash is. That would be... That might be useful. We'll see. Um, hmm. In the meantime, I'm just going with the attitude of push on. I think, I'm not sure we got through this half a cycle before. I do wonder if lowering the temperature on this thing was something to do with the cores. I don't know. Uh, let's see, anyway, let's try change this back. I think also we need to... Uh, uh, make this one higher because this is not not high enough. Uh, 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 oh, we got some research. Nice. The research focus selected. Why not? Yeah, instant crashes. Real. <laughs> Ready to play. <laughs> I don't think Leo's in yet, is he? Is Leo in? Or are you in? Maybe I'm going nuts. Uh... On the list, Leo's not on. He's not on the list. Was he subscribed? I don't know. There you go. Uh, yeah. How far can you? Yeah, they can go three down, four up, two side. Exactly. Bang on. That's the one. Yeah. So it should just add another layer of carbon dioxide. There's still stuff off gassing in here though, which is a problem. We definitely need that. Anyway, we've got loads of food, so. Also, this is still being annoying, isn't it? That little tile of water that just can't get rid of. Okay. Yeah, this is still going. I think we... Here's plan. Build another platform and move this rocket to the other platform and see if that does anything. Um... Yes, tonight is going to be a try stuff and see what happens uh, kind of stream, I think. Because we are being left with very little choice. At least we made it to the end of this cycle. Third time lucky. Leo is subbed? Hmm. I don't know, he's not on my list. Not on my list. Oh, sorry, no, he is on there. Sorry, he's already in the base. He's already in the base. No so mad, I don't remember. Okay, good. Auto save. Good. We made it through this cycle for th after three goes. Uh, where is Leo? Leo, there he is. So of course we got Leo. There we go. Um, you uh, you can do that overpowered, but then dupes can no longer reach through a corner tile to pick stuff up, so that no longer works. It used to work, doesn't work anymore. Um, so. The way you do that is that you then have to use an auto sweeper. Auto sweepers can get through corner tiles, but dupes can't. So. Uh, no rock piles. Um, so yeah, you can set up a system like that, then feed the smaller fridge that, um, that the dupes take from. I did, uh, yeah, I did cover that in the food tutorial by... Quite a long time ago now, but I did cover it. Unreachable dig. No, it's not. It's lying to me, game. Uh, you can do that as well. I just make a pit. I don't think I need to liquid lock it, so I'm just gonna hit it. Could do. I don't. Um, what's actually in here? Polluted. It's polluted dirt in here. 
But it'll overpressure anyway. Alright, it'd be, it'd be fine. It's fine. We have enough. Another quick blueprint. Some bright checkers, there we go. I do want the the plain drywall ones, because actually they're pretty useful for making tutorial bikes with. <laughs> Having a nice coloured drywall. Uh, there's a lot of meat up here as well, like a lot of meat. I think that's, yeah, 85,000 kilocalories across the map, so. This also gives us good amounts of metal, so. Yeah, we've, we've pretty much leveled this. Uh, meanwhile, Operation Umbrella continues, which is going going well. Mm -hmm. but, uh, more meat. Yeah, so Wolfrat and Head Caretaker are our main digging team. They're going to chunk their way through this. Perfect. And then now we can do this. I suppose. Did that not do anything? I did. I suppose we'll have to come down here and seal this off so we don't lose all of the oxygen. Ah, uh, that's going to be a little problem here. I guess we're going to have to box stuff in. And also, we're still not using any of that. Um, I can only come down to here anyway. If we make this the bottom floor, then that means I need to pop some more tiles in to cover these holes. Now we're playing plug the hole. Uh, yeah, that that should be fine, I think. We can't take the freezing anymore. Oh, I'm sorry, Andronic. Uh, yeah, your uh, uni internet or college internet's playing up. Not a lot I can offer you, I'm afraid. Uh, other than... <laughs> You'll have the VODs if you wish to catch up. I'm sorry to hear that. Double sweeper range model. That sounds... Sounds handy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you, Overbow. Uh, it's Andranic on the list. I thought you were at some point. Andranic is already on the list because you were previously subscribed. But there you go. Appreciate that much. You're far too generous. Uh, we will get some dupes stuck up here. I am entirely sure dupes will get stuck, but we'll work it out. But yeah, I'm going to change this to minus 25, but probably do it on, at a time when. Uh, uh, at a time when it's just saved. <laughs> if it crashes, we're all right. Yeah, Wolfrat's now stuck. So that was that was easy to see coming, wasn't it? Where are you stuck? Oh, you shouldn't be stuck. It should be pathable. It looks pathable to me. What about oh, you literally can't get down there. Do you have anything you can build out of over here, or are we just absolutely buggered? I think we may be absolutely buggered. Okay, Wolfrat's going to need that. Oh, you better not die on me, Wolfrat. Uh, this is a bit sketchy. Not allowed by schedule, no pending deliveries. Oh, because you guys are also killing yourselves over here. Uh, right. Everyone's dying up here. There's no there's no mafic in, in range. Come on. You guys just stop killing yourselves. Please. Wolfrat may be dead, I'm afraid. Okay, Tim is being and then running away. Okay, Frisky Whiskey is on it, is deciding to deliver Igneous Rock all the way from there because that's the best place. Nah, he, uh, Wolf, I'm afraid Wolfrat is expired here. That is, uh, Unless he can, he can breathe. Oh, he can breathe the oxygen. Okay, he's fine. He's fine. He can recover breath with the polluted oxygen. So there we go. Can someone come do this? Anyone? Frisky Whiskey is all the way over here. Decided to pick up Igneous Rock from the furthest possible place he could find it. And very slowly bring it. 
Yeah, yeah, he'll be fine. He'll be fine because he's in the suit. Except they've now dug across this as well. Oh no, that's still reachable. Okay, they can jump up and down, I think. Maybe not. Nope, they are trying to kill Wolfrat by not doing this. They're trying. They are really, really trying to kill him. And I will... I'll try not to let them, but they are absolutely insistent. Right. Okay, that's one gap. Can we reach this now? Maybe from someone that's not a million miles away? Okay. Ah, this time, this is what the dupes thought. We thought in order to supply the igneous rock up here, what we should do is go get the igneous rock. Not Let's not get the igneous rock that's here. I mean, that would, that would be too easy. Let's instead go all the way down to the oil biome down here and grab the igneous rock from down there because that's the best place to build rock from when you want to do it on the literal opposite corner of the map. I think they're trying to kill him. I mean, that is that is the only logical conclusion from this behaviour. The problem is, and then they get they get three quarters of the way there because it's so far. Then oh, it's downtime now, and then that's it. <laughs> uh, that's true. I should probably have used the mafic in hindsight, but I thought they were really going to grab some igneous rock. You know, there's igneous rock everywhere. There's igneous rock here. There we go. Right, Wolfrat, can you get inside, mate? Get inside. Come on, get out of there. Dupes. Dupes, they are trolling me. Suffocating, Wolfrat. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, if I do that, he's not going to be able to recover breath, I don't think. Here's the thing, so if you tell them to move, they won't recover breath, even if they can. So moving them can actually kill them. Yes. Yeah, I don't, I've done made that mistake before. So uh, let's not make that one again. Where I've moved them and they've just died on the move. Okay, okay. Printables, what have we got? Who doesn't crash the game? Oh, and research too. We got more research. Do we? Do we even need this stuff? I don't know. Probably not. Are we gonna do it? Sure, why not? <laughs> he was, to be fair, he was tor tortured half to death by his friends, or supposed friends. Well, that was that was not on me. Uh, yeah, we're kind of going to need to need to get across here, guys. Yeah, come on, caretaker, can we? we bail the next one out. Joe has managed to trap himself over there. Alright, no worries, Razor. I'll see you on the way back. So the stream probably going to go a bit longer with all the crashes. We've had to add some time. So, uh, <laughs> the uh, enemies close and your... Uh, no, friends close, enemies close. That's all. We've even got a little bit of singing up here. And then they've annoyingly made it so that they can't reach anything. Uh, got a vaccinator though. I mean, we can we can have that if we wanted to. Well, let's not take that. This is the uh, danger with strip mining. Get these built, please. Yeah, why are we using sandstone for this? I don't know. And uh, Wolf Rat, thank you very much for the sub date. You are. You have been the star of the show today. Um, your fellow dupes are trying to murder you desperately. So, <laughs> thank you very much for continued subscrib subscription, even at your own uh, peril. Uh, we've now got more dupes uh, trying to die up here. Uh, but yeah, yes. Well, the um, uh, the the ones that I showed don't have an evolution chamber though. The the Draco ones. Those are ex excess shearing stations is how I set that up. So I don't know if I actually helped you with that, but you've got um, you've got the the hatchetory bite. I covered um, both evolution chambers, so there's two designs there for you. Um, yeah, they are. Yeah. 
That's true. They do, yeah. Do. I mean, generally, I think that's the best way to deal with them because you, you get the extra resources out of them. Dismantle that. No. Yeah, luckily, this is all full of polluted oxygen, so that's kind of helping. And we got a load of steel, which is good. Uh, again, we've still got more water on here. I wonder if... Um, just replace this with mesh tiles, because I, I mopped this last time. I can see I mopped it, and yet more water has turned up here. I'm guessing this is ice from these meteors and stuff that's melted. So if we just replace this with mesh tiles, just because there's only one tunnel. There's currently a chimney going on here. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Cool, well I'm glad I... Uh, I inspired you that day. Right, I'm going to try this to minus 25 and see if this crashes the game. Maybe that that's what's crashing it. I don't know. Let's not look at it. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> Change it away. But yeah, yeah, you get you get so much more materials out of it doing it that way. So Definitely worth. Um, we can we can do all this, I think. That's the way. Made a mess. Sadat. Right, Sadat is next up on the suicide squad. Um, Let's try to do these, mate. Not the other ones. Can you reach those or not? There we go. I don't think it's good. those are reachable. Uh, where can we go to, Sid? Oh. No. Let's, uh, let's get this done. Please. Can we get Sid? Use the. Yeah, we. Yeah. We'll definitely need to do that. Uh, we have we have more vaccinators elsewhere, I'm sure, don't we? I I don't remember. I do not pay much attention to vaccinators. There's another one down here, yeah. As long as we got one somewhere. Where's the dart? How we do? Let's get inside, please. Okay. Ooh, I thought that crashed there for a second. Didn't look good. <laughs> Uh, yes, this is a, uh, yeah, you've been, you've been almost killed quite a few times, so, there you go. Anyway, we continue on. The strip mining continues, it's digging time. Um, I'm not sure we, we'll get to actually, actually any base building today, but like I said, that's probably not a bad thing because I could do with the time between streams to actually work out exactly what I'm building. I have a rough plan, but... I, I might need to redesign it to fit more people, so... Oh, you guys are all stuck again, are you? What are you stuck on this time, are you? Yeah, okay. It's because it's three high, that's fine. We are Head Taker and uh, Wolf Rat, you are on it. So you're the stars of the show because we're doing a lot of digging today and you are a digger in this base, so... Uh, that makes sense. We, uh, not that. That'll do, we can get that done. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we've, I feel like we've done reasonably. This was kind of up to here, wasn't it, before? It was up to about the rocket. Uh, let's, uh, let's also launch this rocket, grab some more. So I think we've done the hexagon. So that square, that hex is missing, that one's missing, and that corner's missing, so... I suppose we should go for that. Let's launch this and land on the other one and see if we can do that. Uh, the meats will go bad because they exposed. Yes, they do if they're exposed to polluted oxygen. That's correct. So you really don't want that. I think we had that a little bit, but so I'm hoping the carbon dioxide. Once the carbon dioxide, I mean, it, once it's over 1800, it will stop it off gassing anyway. So uh, we'll see. Polluted dirt. Okay, keep checking for polluted dirt in here. We've got four and a half tons. It will slowly disappear. Right, let's begin this one quick before, uh, before it gets buried again. Mm -hmm. Who wants to be on the vaxillator as well? Who do we need? It, it doesn't really matter, does it? I suppose the dupes that are working should probably be probably be vaccinated. Let's rather than the guests, let's do the uh, the caretakers. We have meat at the top. Yeah, that's true. They should be they should be collecting it and putting it into the um, 
into the electric grills. So it, it should be on their to-do list. It's, it's just a question of reachable, I think, um, where it's not reachable in places that's stopping them. So, oh, we've got a bit of a gap here now. Just get that built. Yeah, we do have to be a little bit careful because I'm trying to avoid using ladders across here. So, uh, yeah. Also, that if we avoid ladders, that will make blueprinting this a lot easier because I can just copy paste without having to worry about ladders. That is the is the annoying thing about uh, strip mining with ladders. All right, we'll launch this and we'll land it back on platform at sixty nine. Very nice. Uh, we will land that back over there and see if that solves the problems. We, we might need to you know, run some different lines and stuff, but that's fine. Uh, the carbon oxide also needs to go. Uh, except it can't because there's oxygen. And thank you, Sideblaze, for continuing your subscription. Appreciate that very much. You have been most generous today, especially overpowered as always. I'd be let's let's do this. I need some kind of system to deal with this, but we're still draining this water down. Okay, this will be the temporary base. We'll get rid of this soon, so you don't need to worry too much. Oh, and remember, always remember to finish your vaccinators. Air consumption rate, very nice. That's uh, that's not a, a handy one. It's probably my favourite one. But the um, the buff one's quite good too. Strength is very handy. Can we deconstruct this. Yeah, we can. Pick this long. Do you want to cover this vent? I suppose we should we should leave it. Really, we probably shouldn't do it. Uh, oh yeah. Um, there you go. Free data banks. Good point. Uh, thank you, Ghost Rider, for pointing that out. Always inspect stuff. Why not? Yeah, so it's the it, it's mainly the abyssal light that causes a lot of digging problems because see most of the dupes can't get through it. So uh, we'll have to be a bit careful over here with how we how we dig across because if we dig this, we're definitely going to trap some dupes on the right side. So let's uh, yeah, let's let's sort this out first, and then then we can sort this left side. Be really careful we don't trap any dupes but yeah in the meantime we'll grab some more data banks because why not i think we've got lots of plastic right now i'll find my plastic machine that's the one oh, press Do i have as long as it applies to suits i believe so Tevera. i mean I, logically the answer is yes but i have must be i'm not entirely tested it okay so yeah this is uh there's gonna be strip mine time as the as the name of the stream, I think, quite fairly implies. But, uh, that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be doing lots of digging. We'll always take more clips. In terms of dupe numbers, I suppose what we'll do is... See, this is all full of carbon oxide now, so that's great. Let's just let this go. But yeah, this will never off-gas now, because there's so much carbon oxide in here. Um, Yeah. In terms of food, what we'll do is now we have our, our infinite storage. This is, should all be deep freeze and sterile, which is perfect. So it'll uh, deep freeze and sterile, so it will 0% cycle, which is perfect. Uh, we should now just be able to watch this number, and then we know if this number is going uh, down. Uh, then it's not because it's spoiling, it's because we aren't making enough. So we can watch this for a bit and possibly take more dupes. We'll find out. Mm -hmm. There we go. So yeah, the abyssal light is the tricky bit with this, really. I suppose there's some obsidian as well that will need the super duper hard digging, but the black hat has that anyway, so we are all happy on that front. Meanwhile, Project Umbrella is uh, quarter, third, about a third of the way through at the top as well, so they're slowly working their way through there, which is nice. There we go. Look at that! The, this uh, this digging team is on it, absolutely on it. Look at this sand as well. Uh, there's going to be 
I guess we have to sweep all this stuff up, do we? Or we just bury it under the base? Um. Ooh. Uh, so the key tile is this one. So the way to remember the key tile is start on here and go up two, right one. That is the key tile. As long as we don't dig of that one, uh, we will be fine. Um, yeah, let's uh, come across here. Also, you want to dig no more than four, obviously. Push it over one tile at a time. Oh my god, can you... Um, I don't know if you if you're saying that in earnest, uh, Neo. Neo Na is that Nazet or Naxet? Um, but yeah, sweepies are terrible. They are they are cute, but they are absolutely horrendous at sweeping. <laughs> they move things so slowly. So if you tried to do this with a sweepy, I don't think you would ever finish it in any practicable time. Uh, Auto sweepers move things quicker. So, I mean, we could certainly... Oh, sorry, I'm with you now, Double Decker Soul Wrecker. So you're saying, yeah, use the tile pushing method. So if you... Um, if you uh, put, like, a tile, say, here and here, and here, I think, and then and that... If you build this one, it, it has nowhere to go. Well, on that one. Then it would have to go... It would have to go along. I'm with you. Um... <laughs> Is your game one player? Well, it should be fine. Let's say my the CPU that I upgraded to because of the Mopes Tubes run uh, that you guys uh, helped contribute to, and generous people like you overpowered that helps me upgrade my hardware, um, is able to run. Uh, ten, honestly, Shadow, that is, you know, ten times zero is zero, <laughs> and uh, I only mean that half as a joke. The sweepies are horrendous. They move so little mass and. In, honestly, you know, think about it. Think about this much space. That is... I don't even know how much mass. Hun it's certainly hundreds of tons, if not thousands of tons. They are they are just ill-equipped Ill to move it. I would really not recommend doing that. Okay, good. Well, once we've got this done, we can get our intrepid uh, digger gang out. And then what we'll do is we can start digging this left side as well. Um, we can also can we make that traversal. Uh, these guys here for the meat now, I think. They've come for the meat. <laughs> yeah, I think that's a fair. Picking up meat and now they're idle because they're stuck. Are they? Yeah. Okay, well, we can build that. Um, in the meantime, I think what we'll do is... One, two, three, four. They're going to come up to here. We can start under undermining this, basically. There you go. That should get them all across, I think. Perfect. It's a decoration. <laughs> uh, yeah, well... I mean, they're meant to be useful in terms of, like, sweeping stuff, but they're just... They're just not... It's a shame, but it's also the truth, so... Uh, yeah, bit of a bummer. Okay, anyone else? So yeah, I think they still may try and come for this meat. So I just really don't want to get anyone trapped over there. Yeah, food storage looks fine. I wonder if we can sweep this. Um, as long as this doesn't have any... I don't think you can put edible or... Uh, cooking ingredient on here, so that's fine. I just want to sweep out, like, the plastic and... Nonsense. I think that's it, right? There's no other non food things in here. Perfect. Oh no, there's a bit. It's a bit of light, something just picked up. Yeah, those all look like food to me, so we'll go with that. Yeah. You have R5. Uh, uh, okay, 3500 X. Yeah. Uh. I'm sad to hear that. But yeah, I upgraded to an i5 13600K and it, the the difference, I went five generations on Intel and the difference was just, um, it was huge. So, you know, I can actually run the most tubes base with that. Uh, with anything else, just not going to happen. 
So yeah, this should be, this should be a way up now, so... Again, we can inspect these, don't forget to inspect, you can also rummage them, I mean... It feels a bit redundant to rummage them, but... Yes, I'm pretty sure people are coming down here for the meat. There's still some meat, I think, hidden in there. Got to be a bit careful, but they should have access. Uh, this, ooh, okay, I was going to say they have access this way, but there's a bit of a gap here, so... Would be a good idea to fill. And if they can come up that way, we can dig all this up, so... That's fine. Uh, in order of magnitude is 10 to the 6. You're going to million. Kilograms. That's only a thousand tons. I think there's more than that. Um, uh, well, yeah, so I had a I had an 8600k. Um, so yeah, it's five generations back. Which is still a good chip, but uh, yeah, there, there was a noticeable difference. Okay, so now with that built, yeah, they should now be able to get up both ways. And that means we can have this lot. Ooh, not that. Our space area. This is our non-space area. This is breathable. This is not. Okay. Ah. Yeah, I really got to watch this. Keep uh, over clearing it. Need, yeah, need some kind of better logic for that. Need a I need a gas element sensor. Some carbon dioxide. Can I? Oh, I can't even... I haven't actually opened this door. <laughs> I just realised this door's not open. So, fun fact, you can't actually deconstruct it until it's open, so... Uh, 25 kilos of stuff. Away. I think now I can deconstruct it, which is good. Um, demolish these as well. And then... Yeah, I need to... I want to get that. I want to make this super tidy, because... It would be nice. Okay, so let's do four here and then... Uh, ooh, so if we do four here, what's going to happen is uh, we won't be able to uh, get over here. So what we'll do is, again, we'll undermine this. Uh... And we can do something like this, I think. I think this is safe. Again, don't dig that, remember that. There's a ladder at the right. Oh, yeah, there's a little ladder there. There's a hundred square tiles as far as far. Yeah, okay, yeah. Maybe. Depends on the density of the stuff. When you're saying 500 kilo a tile, it'd be meh. Because the rocks are. The rocks are, the rocks are 800 kilos a tile on the sedimentary there. Um. The granite, granite's 800, igneous is 800, some of it's less, you're right, so the regolith is 450, that's 500, so I think, yeah, with the, it's the rock that really adds to it, in terms of your numbers. Okay, so yeah, I'm just trying to dig this sensibly, so that we don't end up with a complete mess, basically. No, we don't trap any more dupes because I'm rather I'm rather tired of trapping dupes. Should avoid that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I think you're you're right. The ballpark is around uh, a thousand tons. It's quite a lot. It's quite a lot. Yeah, I mean that. Remember that as well. A thousand tons is like is what like that. Think about how much resources you've got on the entire map. It is crazy. Like you can see the numbers on the on the seed tool. On the only assistant, I think that is. So, yeah, and the number, yeah, there's there's so many materials. So don't be afraid, build big. That's my uh, that's my tip for everyone. Can we reach this? trying to deconstruct everything in a sensible way. Um, we'll have this out as well, please. Uh, yeah, I don't know how we're going to deal with this. I mean, I don't think we need it, but you can't deconstruct it. <laughs> so it is going to be in the way, I'm afraid. 
Right. Well. Oh, we're doing well so far. We're doing all right. Doing all right. Building entombment oil well. Well, that's not good. Uh, why is where's the water gun? Where's the water? Water bridge. Why's oh, this got no water? Run out of salt water down here? Ew. Okay. Oh, has that crashed? That crashed when I tried to go into the plumbing overlay. And back we go. We are back indeed. Correct, B Berry. Uh, not sure what happened there. We were doing, we were doing okay for crashes. Uh, and then, then bad, bad stuff. Um, yeah, so this is, that's got buried, which is bad. But also the the, oil, the water stopped because the, uh, the salt water geyser uh, isn't keeping up. So, yeah, well, I mean, well, uh, this is annoying because really we need some water from here, I think. But the output lines are all over here. And the desalinator is here. And we've already got this mess of piping. Where is this going up? This is going to storage. Okay, well let's um let's cut that. Can we turn it down? That's just going in a loop. the right one so we're trying we're trying to send this water down is what I'm trying to do uh, that was not the bridge I wanted okay yeah we'll just send this water that way that'll be fine that'll work itself out can I also get in on this and put a hydro sensor or something because this is just pumping dry which is not ideal yeah the save file is fine, so we just keep going. Just lose a little bit of progress every time. We're still saving every cycle, so yeah. Again, we're monitoring the food because we're around three hundred thousand. Um, so we'll see. Oh, also, this one is um, pouring water into our down here as well, which is probably not what we want anymore. Um, can I? Can I route this to the storage? That is the question. We've made a real mess of. Um, made a real mess of this. Uh, I don't think we want to. We want to be doing this anymore. This is this is not helpful. I need to get this to over here. There's too many lines, and this is very poorly designed. Um, Where's this water? Is this water going up? This is up water. This is up water. This is up something. And this is down. So we'll just have to... There you go. It's probably really wants some thinking about, but we, uh, we haven't done that. Hey, we can, we can rework this whole thing later on if we want to, so... I do like fairly neat pipes. Um, uh, so we empty that. Empty that, please. We don't want salt water in our pipe. We lost hundreds of hours playing modded Minecraft. You mean you lost them because it corrupted, or you you spent them playing it <laughs> as a as a figure of speech? Those are two different scenarios. Uh, okay. These are still... Uh, can we get those dug up, please? Okay, right. Plumber's finally turned up. Yes, yeah, so we'll just send the water into the storage. I mean, why not? We've got loads of water stored down here. 
So much water, that's good. We yeah, we were close to having a water issue, I think, earlier on. And uh sorted that. Maybe we should block this off, I don't know. So I'm thinking this is probably a bad thing to leave open. Let me we'll just close that off. Yeah, I gotta say, I have I've played Minecraft once for about <laughs> fifteen minutes, and I was like, What do I do? I didn't really get it. Um It was like it was like too open, um, and I didn't have an objective. So this kind of like eh. uh, right. Okay, so we lost a load of um a load of stuff here. Tree. I did a bit of digging and then I dug down and I got some stuff. It's like, yeah, I've got some stuff now. What do I do with the stuff? It just it's just like I, I don't know, I don't know. Uh, yeah, we may need some clever digging over here. Get these. Strip mining continues. We bring this back and we'll go for 69. Uh, that's the one we want. Oh, we lost a load of this progress too. Yeah, like vanilla Minecraft addicted to mine. Okay. I'm not sure. I don't, don't see why I wouldn't like Minecraft. It seems like a kind of game I might enjoy. Um, but uh, yeah, I think at this point, I've got enough stuff to be doing, so I'm not going to be picking up Minecraft anytime soon if anyone knows. I had any wishes for that, I'm afraid. Not on this channel. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Can we dig four of these? I think so. Perfect, I think he straps that. May need a ladder here, I think. Not too much build. Yeah, I mean I've seen I've seen cool builds and stuff on it, and yeah. This is completely freeform, isn't it? It's, I kinda the way I kinda see it is 3D pixel art. <laughs> you can uh you can just do pixel art but in 3D. Um But I've I don't know, I've never been that good at art. Thing is, I like creating with him within boundaries if you give me complete freedom just like do whatever you want it's like yeah, blah, 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 I don't know I don't know what to do I need I need some structure to be creative if that makes sense I don't know it's just weird to say on reflection but that, that actually makes a lot of sense to me that's why I like games because you get you get the structure and then you can be creative within the structure why are we uh you see um was this set to Ah, uh, there were no hatches or stone hatches, that's why... Oh, this might be a difficult fight, because these stone hatches are actually uh, some of the hardest things to kill. We might end up with some injuries here, but with the whole team on the on the case, we might... Uh, we might get it. There we go. Maybe that's a screenshot. Here. Everyone's going to be injured now. These are, yeah, these, these stone hatches and smooth hatches are... The toughest things. But anyway, enough dupes and problem solved. Yes, yeah, so we'll drown them in here. That's where they should be going. But I just forgot to put stone hatches on the overflow drop off. So that was a bit of a mistake. Anyway, problem solved. Nothing a bit of uh, violence can't sort there. Kind of the wrong message to be sending out. No. So we'll build that, come across. We'll deconstruct all this too. Just deconstruct everything. Background buildings. Just back to buildings. Deconstruct that again. Yeah, revolt is on it. Like, did, did, did. Mm. Well, that sounds interesting. Hmm. In the research pathway. <laughs> I am the engineer mushroom, that is. 
That is me. Uh, yeah, we have lots of digging. Lots of digging, right? Look at this. This is going. This is going very well. I am pleased. Um, and I'm not going to bother to triage quite everyone because dupes do heal a little bit in their cots every night. So they only got a little bit injured, and they won't get any more injured. So it'll be fine. It'll be fine. We won't have any issues. Uh, it's above a hundred, please. Just let this salt water sort itself out. Stop that pumping so much. Although we probably have way too much power. And uh, Gatling 420, thank you very much for the prime subscription. Um, I'm just daring over power to get to a round number again. Because I think you got gifted one to Andraunik. And now I've got 122 on the list. <laughs> so uh, back to uh, round numbers. Appreciate it. I've got 67 active subscribers. I, I think actually I was higher before when you gifted load more the other time. Before I went on holiday. Also, I must say, so having so many subscribers, I mean, it's great. Then when I have to do the credits for my videos, <laughs> I can put so many names on my thing and I do worry that people can't see them. Oh, the bluff prior is dead. Um, let's replace this. There are better plants that uh, live in hotter temperatures. This is getting quite hot up here. See, now we're overheating. We have an overheating problem, not a cooling problem. We, this may call for a cooling loop at some point. Uh, can you make mushroom logo for your host? Out of play. Yes. So I think, yeah, you kind of stumbled onto where I was going with this, Kathy. You'll see. Stay tuned, and I don't think you'll be disappointed with the design of the base. Not to give too much away, hopefully. Yeah, but let's see. So we've moved this over here. I see all the water is just broken and frozen, so maybe that was the issue. Who knows? Uh, okay. Right, so annoyingly, that's not been dug up. Also, this isn't reachable anymore. What's going on? What's going on? They can't get up here. Okay, well, that's fine. Because we need to... Oh no, uh, yeah, if we just lock these off, that should be accessible. There we go. Oh, you found the game because of me. I, <laughs> how how did you work that out? Because I pretty much only do only stuff. So where did you? How did you find me if you weren't playing any? You just recommended on YouTube or something. But that's uh. That's great. I'm glad I can inspire you to play this amazing game. It is a great game. Um, New Horizons. <laughs> I like to inspire. That is uh, is definitely one of the things I'm extremely happy to do. Oh god, how bad is going again? Beavery. That's 31. Look, you are you are crazy. But I appreciate it very much. I'm sure Beebery does as well. It's been uh, chatting away. There we go. We'll see. I will see if I can accommodate so many people. Ah, okay. Um, the uh, the the bristle blossoms have stopped. So you now use the emotes. Yes, please spam the emotes. Um, so I think we may need to do something about this fairly soon. Um, the this tepidizer is no longer needed. Um, but yes, we wanted to do something because this is, this is overheating now, so we're going to need to put cooling in, finally. Uh, the question is where, and I think I will put this here. Is this going to fly, or is this petroleum going to get in the way? I think we can, I think we can make that work. Um, we'll try, let's try and make this work. Uh, Thermo sensor automation. Uh, take that out. I need the aqua tuner in here. How are we gonna? Uh, which is the transformer? Where's the transformer going? There's not a lot of space. Um, put another one of these up here. We'll put uh, that there. Oh, we can also connect that up to that. We can bridge this down to here. 
Where's the Aquafina power port? Left or right? I feel like it's right, but I don't know. Up to the bridge. Uh, piping. What we'll, we'll, we'll take this loop here. Uh, there's some you can choose colours. Yeah, you, yeah, you've got the drywall. Yeah, the, I mean, I used to have the wallpaper mod that basically did the same thing. But, um... Ooh, let's, um... Let's bring these out here and then like that and this, oh this will have to I suppose come that way. Mm -hmm. There you go. So I built so many of these by now that I can do a cooling loop uh, very quickly. That's only street. And they mentioned, oh well that's great. Who, who, what, do you remember who that was? I should, of course, make sure to thank them. But, uh, <laughs> blast. Uh, the vault has got themselves stuck in here, which is not a thing. Uh, Aqua Tuna Steel, we have a little bit of steel. Uh, how high? What was going on? Where, where, where? can do that, right? Also join together, so let's chop that and then put that in. So it looks sensible to me. Oh, we then will need to put some water in here, so I suppose we can um, yeah deconstruct some stuff for a sec. Ah, it's Ank. Okay, yes, Ank did uh, do me a raid once, so thank you to Ank. I think he's in the base as well, is he? I uh, can't remember. Mm -hmm. uh, I think he's on the list if he's not in the base. So yeah, we'll, we'll put a bottle empty here and just bottle empty some liquids in. That would be a good idea. Oh. Or, we've just had an idea. We could, we could, rather than bottle empty, we could just spill this water into the, uh, into there. How about that? Does that sound like a plan? Spill this water into the, into the into there. Let's go with that. Let's try this. This is an interesting idea. Tube stuck. Oh dear. No fine. Oh yeah. That would not be a good idea. Leo and Super Kadai. Yeah. Can you not build it from below, please? There we go. Trying to stick himself again. Thank you, Shadow Fang. So I need you guys to be watching because I miss these kind of things and then problems. Okay, so yeah, we should be able to dig across there and then we can uh, ladder that up. And let's build our way, dig our way across. Making good progress. Too slowly. Stuck in a watery, uh, watery air. It was on the right tile. See, I thought it was on the right tile. That was my guess, but I didn't go with it. Yeah, we should be able to now just open this and, uh, you know, we can also get rid of this old stuff. Fine. Oh, and then that means we also need to fill it, right? There's a filler. This has already got a filler thing on it. Great, there you go. Um, so you know, down more iron. Let's do some more iron. Why not? Yeah, let's see if this works. So, how is it? Damn it! Thank you, overpowered. Yeah. If we spill this water. The plan is spill it into here. The question is, will any of it go over the top? I don't think so. No, we might get some, uh, I think we'll get some fluid oxygen stuck in this right corner because that's usually how it goes. So, in that case, all we need to do then is just deconstruct this right tile and it will allow the water to push the gas out, so. Uh, yes, yeah, so here's the plan. Chop this. Uh, and then I suppose we need to uh, insulate across there. 
Here we go. So if it's above. Ooh, what's a good temperature? Um, 25, 20, 26, 25. Not good. Obviously, it's not going to do anything immediately. Give that a sec. Let's wait for the water. And then there will be a gas pocket here. I'm sure the oxygen will get squeezed into the right side. There we go. So we've got two gases in there. So we just deconstruct these. Uh, we can mop this up too. And giving them lots of stuff to do right now. And there's so much water in here that it's actually going to take a while to uh, just make anything. So yeah, so now you check, see the gases. There's no gases in here. This is all water. It means we can uh, build these back up. And we get that swept out. Nothing to stop us doing that immediately. Sweep two, why not? To save the bit of rock we've got, and uh, Nenesh is trying to build himself in. Right, building in two minutes. Ah, oh, look. Okay. Right, okay, so we had some uh, slime meteor shower. At least, uh... Okay, so we can't get across there. We can get up that. How's... Oh, Operation Umbrella is working. We are stopping some... The lime meteors, which is helpful. It's how stop getting in the way of what we're trying to dig. Okay, and then we just put the uh, steam turbine back on here, and job done, right? So this aquatuna is now cooling away. It'll be a while before we make any steam, but it's fine. Yeah, now we can at least take the heat out of the base. Uh, where's the? Is this all cooling up, or is this? No. Uh, this is being heated by the. Um, by the metal refinery, because I did not put a proper solution in for that at all. This is the cooling loop, so if we put some copper in here, that, um, that will help that area counteract the SPOM and the metal refinery. Fingers crossed. So, because I've put so much water in here, much more water than normal, it's going to be a long time before we get to... Um, before we get to steam, so not a problem. In the meantime, we'll just keep dumping heat into the water. Got loads of reed fiber now. Well, 22. It's not loads. It's some. Okay. Keep an eye on the digging. This is diggable now. There we go. We go up here and dig all this across. I think everything else is fine. The, um, yeah. Oh, the bristle, bristle blossoms are now back online too, which is great, because they overheated. Uh, so we should be able to pull this whole base down quite nicely, I think. Give it a number of cycles and we'll see the, see the output from that. Okay. okay so just manually connecting this still, because what we really want to do is put this right at the bottom, but... We'll just keep dumping carbon dioxide like this a little bit manually. We can do stuff that's manual. It's not uh, not the end of the world. Okay, right. Wolf rat has found his way across here. Good, great. We can uh, keep digging up here. I suppose we can leave that intact. And keep going over here. Any reason? Any reason why not? I don't see one. Just dig, dig, dig. And leave that. Printables. Sure, take some plastic. Uh, still keeping an eye on the food. So I think once the bristle blossoms come back online, because they were offline for a while, um, we'll solve the problem. But yeah, I mean, there's some copper pipes in here. You see how quickly this comes down. It's already about 40 degrees, which is a bit hot. Not dangerously hot, but uncomfortably hot. As you say, because we're, we're pushing this really hot refinery coolant back out, which is why this is overheating. But yeah, with the coolant loop there, give it a bit of time, this thing will work its way around. Pushing out 15 degrees, so the whole base will get nice and green again. I think it'll go a little bit yellow and orange for a second. Um, 
right but for this second i think we are going to call this end of the episode here on youtube uh hopefully this is about the right time again with the crashes it's a little difficult to judge um and, uh, thank you very much for watching this episode and i'll see you in the next one